hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new so today is national tea day this is the card i ended up creating i think it turned out super cute and you could totally change up the sentiments to make this a get well card um but because this is tea day i thought i'd go with a sentiment which is incorporating the word tea so i'm using tea time by honeybee stamps and then the sentiment was from the pucker up sugar pea design stamp so I want to start using different color card bases compared to what I normally do. So if you guys have followed me for a while, you'll know because of my craft space, I don't have a lot of room to, you know, store different color card stock. So generally what I do is I only have white card stock and then I'll ink blend it or color the background. That way I can, you know, always have a white card base because I feel like white is probably the easiest color to change. But I do have craft and I also do have black card stock. The only thing with the black card stock is obviously the majority of the time if I want a sentiment. It has to be white embossed onto the, the card or it has to be a banner die. Um, otherwise you wouldn't be able to read the sentiment. So that's the only thing and me and heat embossing do not get on. But yeah, I'm going to insert some music, I'm going to speed the process up. The next update was right at the beginning and it's going to be World Penguin Day. So if you like penguins and you, you want to make a card with a penguin, you know, you can do that. Just include the hashtag National Holiday, um, April Holiday Hop 2024. Um, and if you want to be a part of the group where I give you the graphic, then you just have to give me a message over on my Instagram and I will send you that as well. So feel free to join guys and I'll see you in my next video.